Morning, Richie. Morning, Troy. It's just a normal day for social studies teacher Brian Holgate. Typically, it's going to be the press secretary. Teaching his students everything they need to know about the U.S. government. We'll work on it. Keeping them focused and interested in a subject some students might not be so focused or interested in. Have at it. Get to work. Across the school, this class is also getting to work, just in a different way. Today's leg day, so we're doing squats. Leg day, a universally hated day. And one more set each. Unless you have Coach Amos to get you through it. Oh, God. <laughs> Coach Amos. Uh, I mean, he treats us all like family, you know. It's really like a special thing we have here at HS. But what stands out about these two random classrooms? Backwards on the way back. Just look at the front of the rooms. Okay. These two have been mainstays at Coeur d'Alene High School for decades. This is year 23. 20 plus years now. Yeah. And they aren't the only mainstays either. When I started here, we had teachers that had been here for 20 some years and some legends that I, I couldn't imagine going anywhere else because it's the, what, what these people have, have done. What they've done to build a community worth sticking around for. I think a lot of people have jobs where they, they just go to do a job and this isn't a job, this is, this is, this is my life. For four years now, CHS has kept around 90% of their teachers every year. Mm -hmm. Back in 2018, it was as high as 94% coming back. That ranks CHS 70th for teacher retention out of more than 600 schools statewide. So why are teachers sticking around? I think it's more of just the tradition that we have at the school. <laughs> we try to make our decisions based on what's best for students. I think that environment creates a, a work environment you want to stay in. Because in the end, it's about helping each kid succeed. It takes a lot of work, but it's very rewarding. And it helps that both teachers are pretty passionate about their jobs. They love it so much that during football season, they work more than 80 hours each. It is the kids that, that makes me do what I do and, and, and care about the school as much as I do. I call it a dream job. In Coeur d'Alene, Nicole Hernandez, Creme 2 News.